A Zen master was on the way to his monastery. He had to walk up the hill. It was a beautiful, sunny and windy day. As the Zen master walked up the hill, people greeted him along the way. He entered his monastery and he heard two of his disciples arguing about something. As the master was passing, the disciples noticed the master suddenly and stopped talking they greeted the master and one of the disciples told the other disciple that it was better to tell the master their dispute so that he can give them an answer the disciples told the master their question master you see the flag on top of our monastery it is moving I am saying that the flag is moving and he is saying no it is not the flag that is moving but it is the wind that is moving we have been debating about this since morning but we couldn't come to a conclusion can you please tell us what is really moving here the master replied it is neither the wind nor the flag that is moving it is your mind that is moving zen stories are often in the form of a dialogue which is puzzling or paradoxical they are purposely made this way by the zen master The stories provide no explanations and can appear with no logic or meaning but the stories can have multiple meanings depending on one's spiritual progress or the state of one's mind they were given by the master to help the zen student reach self realization the zen student has to meditate upon this and not ponder over its meaning intellectually A Zen story is meant to shatter one's mind or to help one go beyond what we normally refer to as mind. Thank you.